My name is Sébastien Dubois, and I'm the head of programs at Clean Aviation. Today, I am answering some key questions about our first call for proposals, which was launched on the 23rd of March to start our journey towards climate neutral aviation. Clean Aviation is the new European Research and Innovation Program for transforming aviation towards a sustainable, climate neutral future. We bring together the entire European aeronautics sector, industry members, research organizations, SMEs and universities to work together to reach climate neutral aviation by 2050 in line with Europe's ambition to be the world's first climate neutral continent. Clean Aviation was launched on 30th November 2021. And now we are pleased to announce that the first call for proposals has been launched to get us off to a flying start. In clean aviation, we are focusing our research through three technology thrusts of skipper generation technologies. These three thrusts are hybrid electric and full electric concepts, ultra-efficient aircraft architectures, and hydrogen-powered aircraft. Our first call for proposals reflects this thrust with 14 topics working towards climate-neutral aviation. This call is worth 736 million. This is the largest call ever launched since the start of the Clean Sky program back in 2007. All topics are fully open to competition without activities already assigned to parties. We expect to select up to 23 projects with the aim to develop and mature the disruptive technologies set as priority in the strategic research innovation agenda across the three thrusts and to define the future regional short and short medium range aircraft concept. Our objective is to meet a maturity level equal or higher to chair 4 by 2025-2026 depending on the nature of the activity. This first program phase should confirm the future aircraft concept and associated technologies to be tested on ground or in flight in the second part of the program to deliver the expected impact, which is reducing the greenhouse gases emission by 30%, exploiting the results by 2035 with a new aircraft entering into service, and replacing the fleet of aircraft by more than 75% by 2050. Clean aviation courts are truly open. We welcome everyone to apply who thinks they have an innovative solution to one of the topics proposed. The size and scope of the research topics calls for projects spanning from 3 to 100 million euros of EU funding support. They will all be complemented by in-kind contribution to activities that will amount to 1.5 times the funding value of which the contributing activities implementing at EU, national and regional level across Europe in synergy as implemented by the members and the associated members. The participants will have to work in consortia built around skills and capabilities required in the different topics. The consortia can be composed of industry members, research organizations, SMEs or universities from across European Union member states or countries which are associated to the EU's Horizon Europe Research and Innovation Programme. First, take a look at the topic list and decide where you can best bring your ID on board. Then, Think about your consortium. Which other expertise do you need to cover the topic, to exploit the results, and to deliver the necessary impact on the future generation of aircraft by 2035? Reach out to partners which might be able to support you. You don't always need to cover the topic in full. The topics calling for only one project have to be covered in full by the applicants, but the one calling for two or three projects may partially be covered as indicated in the text. The application form consists of two parts. Part A, 
which includes the administrative information about the participants and the proposal. And part B is the project content of the proposal structured around the three main criteria of the evaluation excellence, impact, and implementation. This part is limited to 120 pages and will be prepared following the proposal template issued with the call documents. This document will be complemented with annexes, including additional information, such as CVs and expertise of consortia participants, resources, financial details, and project organization, but without any page restriction. Check out our website for a full rundown on the application form, which will be available on the European Commission's Funding and Tender Opportunities portal soon. The call closes on 23rd of June at 5 o'clock p.m. Brussels time. So make sure you submit your applications by that time. Don't leave it for the last minute. After that, we start the evaluation process which takes two months. The participants may be invited in August to an hearing session in case this is deemed necessary. The winning participants will hear back from us in September when they will receive the outcome of the evaluation. The grant preparation will immediately start with the objective to sign and pre-finance the grants by the end of the year. The list of projects confirmed for implementation will be subject to the approval of the ranking list by the governing board in October. We have a special Q&A mailbox for this call, as shown on your screen. You can submit your questions here, and we will publish all the answers in two or three batches on the European Commission's Funding and Tender Opportunities portal. Clean Aviation is also hosting info days around Europe, in Turkey on the 31st of March, in the Netherlands on the 7th of April, in Spain and April in May. Join us then to learn more and ask your questions directly to me and my colleagues. Good luck with your applications. I'm looking forward to seeing your innovative proposals and getting started on clean aviation.